M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So we're going to start comparing the 705 and the 710. We're going to use two separate antennas. Uh, so let's set them up. So this antenna is a portable uh, 49 to 1 uh, ballon with a 66 foot length of wire. Purchased from MW0SAW. So I use this when I'm testing. So it's nice and portable and I've got a nice long patch lead here, which I'm going to need. And I'll show you the antenna I'm using as well. So up here we've got the LW20DX. It's basically a long wire going all the way along there. You can't really see it. And it has a 9 to 1 ballot, which is in there. It works well and it doesn't tune exactly, but it tunes near on my memory is 2040, possibly 80. But then you've got the uh, this one here, which I'm going to put up now, stretch it across to that tree over there, and then we're just going to compare signals. So let, let's give it a go. So we just perched it there on that, and then we can sort of unwind it. Uh, it's quite a clever design. It unwinds very easily. Okay, it's up there, and it's stretched out. It's going over to that bush and over to that tree there. Just going to uh, attach a BNC connector there and then uh, tuck it through this window to my shack and then we'll have two antennas to test them quite a long coax longer than I need but it will do it's new and it has a BNC which is going to connect to our antenna okay that's good it's gonna I bought these this one actually on eBay because I'm so bad at soldering and let's get it onto the 705. Now we'll have a look. Right, we've got them connected. We've got the external monitor for the 710 as well. So let's uh, have a look. Right, we're here. Let's turn down the 710. We're going to turn up. That's the 705. It's about the nearest you're going to get to seeing a 7300 because I haven't got a 7300. So we're obviously not in 3D scope. Let's just find something strong. And there's a lot of German contests today. One thing I will point out is that with the 710, when you go into sort of this waterfall style mode, and I've chosen colour the green one there, so number 10. Uh, let's go back, and I've also put the level minus five dB, just tap it and change it here. Although you get a very similar scope, it's not rich with color uh, the way that, with the adjustments I've made in the 705, you get all those little trickles of red, which is showing you, you know, you know different strengths and stations. But anyway, with the 710 you get the 3d don't you so you go 3d and the color i like is i go to color and then choose i think it's probably that one and push function and the db level i go to actually minus about 25 before it i like it and then obviously you get the 3d scope So let's, I find it easier with the, that, and you've got the multi knob there. And on the other, on the 705, you go, I think it's pretty sh function. Uh, which one is it to get the uh, audio scope? Let me just check. Go menu, audio scope. And if you want both, pretty sh hold down scope. There you are, no. Menu, audio. Let's just work it out. Yeah, I just push the M scope and you've got both. So let's, this is on the 705, 192.60. We've got the, the span at 500k. Roger, Roger. 
Kilo Radio. So seven one nine two eight six seven. And the 705. Yeah, it works good. Both sounding great. So let's go, let's come out of the multi. We'll use the different color screen. So we'll go color number 10. That makes it, and then we'll expand it as well. Set, set that on number five. That's what I find works well. Got an M6 station then. Span 500. Should we try and call? What power we got? Function. Which I don't want to transmit so close to the 705, so I won't. So the antennas we're using on the top one, on the 705, it's a 49 to 1 Ballon antenna with 66 foot length of wire. On the bottom radio, it's a nine to one ballon uh, with a long wire. I'll just let you know the length. Yeah, it's a 20 meter wire. I'm told it'll work on 80 meters, though I don't really have much fun on 80 and even on six. But anyway, uh, that's what we've got on the 710. So, and the idea is that with that, you, you do need a tuner. Well, with the 49 to one antenna, and it's 67 foot length of wire, you will get 40, 20, 15 and 10 meters. With a, with twice the length, 132 foot, you'll get 80, 40, 20, 15 and 10. So that's what I need to do is add that extra length on, which I have done in the past actually. So, you know, both very capable antennas, obviously the, how you put them up is important. Mine's only about five foot from the ground, so it's not gonna be great, but it's just for testing. Uh, but I still get quite good results, um, you know, in Europe. So let's uh, turn it up again and just tune through on the bottom one. They're all squashed together, aren't they? You get wider tuning with the DSP knob. So it's worked all worked all Germany. That's the problem. Not the problem, but it means that the bands are pretty much clogged up. Okay, let's go to the 705, tap that, go to 7165, turn it up. <laughs> One oh three. We can do the the radio one side. So it's quite a good Right. Seven oh five down. Seven one oh up. Uh, speaking on the radio, listening to greetings messages uh, from uh, from uh, scout groups uh, to the country. Then we'll put the 3D on. 
the 15 different uh, scout groups uh, yesterday, so it's been, it's been quite good uh, speaking uh, to the scouts. So I'll hand the microphone back to you, Ryan. Uh, golf Bravo 2, Charlie, Whiskey Romeo, Golf Bravo 0, Golf Delta Sierra, listening. <laughs> So I think you find that interesting. I mean, it's such a tough choice to make if you've got these. The external display is a big plus, isn't it, for the 710 or the, if you're going to buy the 7300 or the 705. The 705 and the 300, you can use the, use the RSBA1 software, which is actually quite inexpensive now. I mean, they're selling it on uh, eBay for £25. And it does work, but you, you don't get the full screen. I don't know why they haven't done that. You do get a scope with the RSBA1 version 2, but they, make, they, they limit it to not filling the screen. I don't understand why they do that, because that would make a big difference for £25. But, um, you know, Yesu have adopted this style of radio now with the 101, with the FTDX10, now the 710, and there's definitely more radios and I would say they're bringing out in the next year or so a 705 style radio and possibly the new a new version of the let me think now I'm not sure what they're going to do about the 818 because it's such a, a good seller isn't it uh, but anyway so I hope you find that interesting thanks to MW0SAW for for the antenna that he sold me there for uh Forty nine to one Bannon. We'll come back with a another comparison because I've got the nine nine one here, so we may as well compare them. Bye for now. Seven three.